you got a foot like a boss. You got a boot like a boss. What is up, bosses? Nachum here. Incredible feature update. We have a new event type for you. If you are on our cappuccino or latte plans or any plan that has group bookings, you'll see that you now have events listed in your dashboard. Just click on that. And what we're going to do is we're going to create a one, uh, one day event at one time. So we're going to name it. We'll call this the uh, million dollar webinar. And this is good for webinars. Uh, in-person events or virtual events, Zoom, or any other thing. Now we have different calendars to connect to. Um, I'm not going to connect to any of them right now. We'll just click continue. Choose a date and time. So we'll say we'll make this event for uh, July 29th. Pick a time. We're going to do this at 2 p.m. Done. And this will be a one-hour event. Now, of course, if you go over it, that's not a problem. This is what will be blocked off in your uh, calendar. So let's say there's going to be a one hour event. I'm going to do, um, let's do 30 minutes of padding before or after the event. And I'll create it in Zoom since I have Zoom integrated and click finish. And boom, we now have our million dollar webinar template set up. And you'll see that you can view the details of the Zoom uh, link. If you don't, if you want to remove Zoom, just click delete meeting and it will remove the Zoom link from there, or just create Zoom link and it will go back. Now this could be a free uh, free meeting, or if you want to charge for people attending, you could put a price in there, so let's say it's $100. Now we're gonna take online and offline payments. Now you could do you could do one-on-one -on -one meetings with people if you have a specific date and time. And, but let's do, we're gonna make this uh, 10,000 people, because I want a lot of people coming to this meeting. And you have your regular cutoff, cancel periods, etc. cetera. Um, amazing webinar that will for sure make you $1 million. You know, some kind, some kind of an awesome webinar like that. Success message, thanks so much. Looking forward to seeing you live, okay? And you have the auto redirect. Also, you can redirect the URL to your home page after someone makes this booking. We have a countdown timer. So if you want to show it, just keep that checked. And uh, if you do not want to receive, like if you have like 500 people um, emailing you, uh, 500 people attending your events, you probably don't want to get email notifications for every single booking. So we by default have this checked. But if you do want to get emails and see who's who's uh, um, who's who signed up for the event, just uh, unclick that and you're good to go. Okay, if you wanna edit it, you could edit before someone books, you could still edit the date and time and duration, et cetera. But we're gonna save our changes here. And of course you have the URLs, you can customize, everything works uh, the same way. Again, you could change your profile details, all this stuff, you could you know custom uh, photos, every single webinar, every single event, you could customize with your own text colors, um, etc. If you want to use different fonts, you can do that. Save changes, etc. Testimonials, facts. You could have testimonials and FAQs about that specific event. And of course, you could choose custom fields, reminders, SMS and email, and of course, add text emails, which we'll get back to in a couple of minutes. But um, right now, we're going to uh, we save changes. So let's go back and let's see what it looks like. We have, of course, you have a light version and a full version. So this is what the full version looks like. You know, that's waiting to open. I'll just open up the, the light version as well so we can take a look. All right, so here's the full version. You have the countdown timer. You see we customize the fonts. And of course, this can be customized. The testimonials, the FAQs, everything can be customized for this specific event. And of course, it can be booked. And of course, if you have Stripe, Square, PayPal, you can take payments online, or you can take offline payments if people are gonna pay you in person. Or again, if you make it free, then there'll be no payments showing up. Amazing webinar, of course, you can put more text here. You can add, um, oh, here's the light version you can take a look at. On the full version, you'll be able to add videos like you would any other 
event. So let's go edit. And, uh, and over here, you'll be able to add uh, YouTube videos um, or photos that will add uh, to that specific event. So very exciting. You, you could use this unlimited. You could create as many events as you want. Uh, but let's go back and let's create another one. I want to show you something else. Let's call this one the trillion dollar webinar. So let's say you don't, you're not using Zoom. Let's say you want to use Facebook Live. We're not going to take any calendars. And we'll do this one, let's say, for July 27th. And we'll do it at 4 p.m. Done. Okay, we're not going to create the Zoom, but we will create an hour. And we're not going to, we'll, uh, we'll create some padding. Why not? Let's say 30 minutes. We're not creating a Zoom. We're clicking Finish. So we have our trillion dollar webinar, which is going to be awesome. Be awesome. And what we're going to do here is we are going to now create a live stream, right? So we're going to call this the from YouTube live stream trillion dollar webinar. For now, we'll keep it unlisted because this is just for demo. Schedule for later. So we're going to schedule it for July twenty seventh. What did we say, 4 p.m.? I think that's what we said, right? You can upload a custom thumbnail and create stream. Okay, you could walk through uh, YouTube stream and all this different stuff. But what we're interested in is in taking this stream URL and you're gonna wanna just copy this. Okay, so now we have the live stream URL and now when somebody books this event, what you're going to want to do is add the success message. You can put here is the unique streaming URL. Just put it in there. That way, the success message will have that in there. Click Save Changes. In addition, we're going to put it into your confirmation. We're not going to use global because it's specific for this event. Looking forward to seeing you at the live event. Here is the streaming link to join. And of course, this works with anywhere else, any other uh, platform where you get a link that you can send people. Click Save Changes. And let's just, um, the reminder emails also, you want them to for sure have the link there. The link to join. Again, you get it, save changes. So now every reminder email will also have that link in there. So if you set up reminders and you can add email or SMS reminders, let's say email reminders, you wanna do it uh, three days before, send it to your, well, you don't need to send it to yourself because you know about this event. So just we're just gonna send it to your client and not to yourself, click save. And let's say an hour before you want to send email to yourself, and we're going to actually do an SMS, save, boom. And now people will get um, that information. And that is our events. This is for one-time events. Much more still to come. Hope you enjoy this feature. And I can't wait to see the different webinars, events that you create with this uh, special feature.